The Evolving Story of Pembroke Welsh Corgis Pembroke Welsh Corgis, a look at their evolutionary history when you think of Pembroke Welsh Corgis, you may envision their adorable short legs and expressive faces. These charismatic dogs have become popular pets worldwide, known for their intelligence and loyalty. But have you ever wondered about the evolutionary history of these remarkable creatures? In this article, we will delve into the origins of Pembroke Welsh Corgis and explore how they have adapted over time. One of the first things to note is that Corgis are a distinct breed with a rich lineage. While often mistaken for a separate breed, the Cardigan Welsh Corgi, Pembroke Welsh Corgis have their own unique history that can be traced back centuries. Their story begins in Wales, where they were initially bred as herding dogs. The exact origins of the Pembroke Welsh Corgi are still somewhat mysterious. However, many experts believe that they can be traced back to the Swedish Valhund, a Spitz-type dog that accompanied Viking settlers to Wales around a thousand years ago. These Viking dogs interbred with the local herding dogs, resulting in the creation of the corgis we know today. Early on, corgis were highly valued for their exceptional herding abilities. Their short stature and nimble bodies allowed them to nip at the heels of cattle and drive them in the desired direction. Furthermore, their strong and powerful bark made them excellent working dogs on the Welsh farms. Their herding skills were so noteworthy that legends and folklore soon developed around these remarkable dogs. As time went on, corgis became fixtures in the Welsh countryside. They were deeply ingrained in the local farming community and were often given high praise for their hard work and loyalty. However, it wasn't until the early 20th century that they caught the attention of the wider world. In 1925, a small group of corgis were introduced to the British royal family. Queen Elizabeth II, then a young girl, fell in love with the breed and requested one as a pet. Her first corgi, Dookie, was followed by a long line of beloved corgis that have since become synonymous with the royal family. The Royal Association propelled the popularity of Pembroke Welsh Corgis to new heights. Suddenly, everyone wanted to have a corgi of their own, and breeders worked diligently to meet the demand. However, it is important to note that the transition from working dog to popular pet brought about changes in the breed. As more emphasis was placed on aesthetics and personality traits, the physical appearance of Pembroke Welsh Corgis started to change. Their legs became shorter, and their bodies longer. These alterations were desired for their cute and distinctive look, but they also had an impact on their functionality as working dogs. Today's Pembroke Welsh Corgis retain some of their herding instincts, but they are primarily cherished as cherished companions. In recent years, there has been a growing concern among pet enthusiasts about the impact of selective breeding on the health and well-being of certain breeds. Pembroke Welsh Corgis are no exception. The breeding for certain physical features, such as their short legs, has been linked to potential health issues like intervertebral disc disease and hip dysplasia. Efforts are being made to address these concerns and promote responsible breeding practices. It is crucial to prioritize the health and quality of life of these beloved dogs. By raising awareness and supporting responsible breeders, we can ensure the well-being of future generations of Pembroke Welsh Corgis. In conclusion, the evolutionary history of Pembroke Welsh Corgis is a fascinating one. From their origins as hard-working herding dogs to their current status as beloved companions, Corgis have made their mark on history. While changes in their appearance have occurred over time, their endearing personalities and loyalty have remained constant. By understanding their past, we can better appreciate these unique and remarkable creatures that have captured the hearts of so many around the world.